Hi, I'm Kevin Beck and welcome to First Look, where we'll be giving you a first look at a new Lenovo product. Today we're going to be covering the ThinkPad 11e and I've got here with me David Harris. How you doing Kevin? Doing well David. David is the product manager for the ThinkPad 11e, so we're going to talk extensively <laughs> about all the new, uh, about all the new goodness. That's right. That's right. <laughs> so just a little bit of overview. Uh, the concept behind the 11e is that we wanted to take what we had learned previously in our other education offerings, yes. right, build something new, and add a new form factor. That's right. So <laughs> we actually went to a lot of our customers and asked, mm -hmm. where do we go from our X131e? Right. Um, our customers said they love the form factor, they love for it to be thinner and lighter, mm -hmm. uh, but there were some customers who also wanted to take advantage of tablets, uh, uh, but they didn't want to give up keyboard. A little bit torn, right? Mm -hmm. So that, that, that became the genesis of what uh, this product here, 11E, is. Mm -hmm. uh, we're offering both the clamshell design as well as the yoga form factor. Awesome. So best of both worlds. The best of both worlds. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. So let's talk a little bit about uh, you know, what we, we changed. Like you said, we, kn we knew we had to make it a little bit thinner, mm -hmm. a little bit lighter. So where are we at on that? Yeah, so we challenged our developers, mm -hmm. uh, and we were able to actually make this 30% thinner. 20% uh, awesome. lighter, awesome. keep the same ruggedization specs. Awesome, awesome. So yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that a yeah. lot in a little bit, but let's kind of get into some of uh, you know what we think are the key features that we're enabling both on the clamshell and mm -hmm. the uh, the yoga flip around models for uh, for education with these. Yeah, so so obviously with the with the addition of the yoga uh, mm -hmm. mode, mm -hmm. uh, we have the ability to do multi-touch on this device where we Excellent. didn't have that before. So right. that, 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 that certainly helps some customers. Mm -hmm. um, we also have the activity LED that is, mm -hmm. uh, that's a carryover from our pre previous product yeah. uh, that allows a teacher to stand in front of a mm -hmm. sea of students and yep. determine if they're all on the same page or not, whether yeah. they're all on wireless or right. not on wireless. Yeah, I know you folks won't be able to see it from here, but it's, but it's right here. There's a nice wide LED on the back, so a teacher can look out across a sea of students and see who's doing what they're supposed to be doing and, <laughs> exactly and, and, right. and otherwise. Yes, yes. Yeah, we've got the full four, four mode, uh, uh, multi-mode enablement on the yoga models. Yes. Right, so we've got our uh, our stand mode over here. Mm -hmm. We've got our laptop mode. Yep. We've got our tent mode. Yep. Uh, and then all we have to do is pick this up pull that around and we're in full tablet mode. And it works great for education, whether mm -hmm. students are uh, kind of in this mode consuming media or whether they're in a, a content creation mode and uh, using the laptop yep. or in a, in a mode where they're actually reading a book and uh, just need to hold something right, right in yeah, front of them. Absolutely. All right, so you know, you talked about durability. I know that's been a key focus for us in mm -hmm. the education models. Yes, uh, it's something ThinkPads are known for. Yes, right. But what are we what are we doing above and beyond that? You know, some some things that we're doing specifically for education in these models. Yeah, that, 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 that's great. You asked. Um, so you, you'll notice immediately that there's a rubber bumper that runs around the top of these devices. Mm -hmm. uh, that's to prevent uh, the corners from uh, be, being broken when it's uh, either dropped in a book bag or dropped on the floor. Yeah. Uh, Wait, a student, a student dropping a laptop? Maybe, maybe. <laughs> uh, uh, the pillow top cover. There uh, prevents it uh, from being uh, uh, impacted when it's in a book right. bag, right, full of books. Yep, totally makes sense. Um, so those are some of the things you see uh, on the outside. Mm -hmm. uh, when you open up the, 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 the system, you'll also see the keyboard. Mm -hmm. uh, we've modified the keyboard a bit this year. Uh, we've actually anchored each key into the into the keyboard base so that right. students can't pry the keys right. off. Again, this is not something that's immediately obvious from the outside, but if you were to sort of dig in and look, you'd see that every keycap, as it goes down under the bezel around it, actually has two hooks on the outside right. that keep the key from being able to be ripped off. Yeah, exactly right. Yeah. Uh, so, so a big kudos. Uh, we, we've been told from our customers for that. Yeah. Uh, addition to that, we also have uh, all the ports are reinforced so mm -hmm. that uh, they won't wear out over time as students right. kind of uh, insert right. and uh, take things pulls out it around by the cable that's right. kind of thing. That's exactly yep. right. Yep. Exactly. Uh, I know we've got full mil spec testing on these as well. Yes, we do. Yep. Right. Yep. So in Every, in every sense of ThinkPad, uh, plus a little extra for it's education. It's a ThinkPad through and through, uh, plus, plus our education criteria on top of that. Yeah, yes. excellent. Well, let's talk, um, so that's the outside. Let's talk mm -hmm. a little bit about some of the fundamental technology, because I know that's something people are going to be interested in. So processor-wise, what are we looking at? Yeah, so we have a great Intel uh, Baytrail M Celeron processor for this device. Mm -hmm. uh, makes it quick and speedy. We're also going to have a 34 watt hour battery right, uh, right. for up to eight hours of performance, uh, battery life on a Chromebook. Perfect. Uh, and up to six and a half hours, seven hours on a, on a Windows device. Okay, excellent. Uh, this is an 11 six inch display. Mm -hmm. That's going to be a high definition display. Um, and on our yoga systems, that will be uh, touch enabled with a nice IPS display as well. Right, and I know with, we got uh, chemically hardened glass. Chemically as well. hardened glass to protect that is when it's mm -hmm. in tablet mode. Yep, totally makes sense. Uh, what about storage? What, are, what kind of options do we have available on storage there? That's a great question. So, so in addition to two modes, we also mm -hmm. uh, have support for, for Windows, uh, mm -hmm. which would give us a hard drive storage up to 500 gigabytes mm -hmm. uh, and solid state storage up to 128 gigabytes. Mm -hmm. Excellent. On totally a device with a Chrome operating system, uh -huh. we would have a 16 gig flash, which okay. is standard for most Chromebooks. Yeah, makes sense. So, you know, we end up be having uh, four different offerings here because we've got uh, clamshell, 
and yoga in both Chrome OS offerings and Windows offerings. That's exactly right. So uh, that's obviously something that came to us as a customer requirement from education. What's, uh, what's the rationale behind that? Yeah, so, so we have a lot of customers who have built their um, the curriculum around Windows, mm -hmm. right, and supporting Windows. So, so those those customers are our bread and butter. They're, they're they've, mm -hmm. they've been there. Uh, we certainly wanted to make sure they were satisfied. Mm -hmm. But then we've got some customers in education who have switched mm -hmm. over to a Google ecosystem. Right. Uh, and Chromebooks make the most sense there. Mm -hmm. uh, when you're looking for something that's uh, that's that's very quick to boot time yep. uh, and also easy to manage on the back end with yep. a smaller staff. Hence the four discrete offerings. Hence for all the those four discrete offerings. Combinations and that's permutations. Exactly right. Okay. Uh, so just a brief note on uh, one of the accessories that we've got available mm -hmm. here. Uh, uh, this carry in case, right? We've got uh, something that is uh, has attachment straps on the inside. So of course it can be removed, but it can be sure. zipped around and opened up and uh, opened up and used in the case. Uh, it's very, a very thoughtful design. Yeah, right, very convenient. A little extra added layer of protection there. That's right. That's exactly right. So um, you know, we've talked about protection. We've mm -hmm. talked about the technology offering, uh, but sort of as they say, beyond the box. Yes. Right. Something that IT administrators are uh, deeply concerned about mm -hmm. is the service and support offerings that we have available around these products. What have we uh, got available there? Yeah, so this is right in the ThinkPad wheelhouse. Mm -hmm. uh, so so these systems can all um, uh, have, have image service available. Mm -hmm. uh, you can also do asset tagging, right, uh, as these right. will be owned by schools mm -hmm. in some cases. Um, you also have the ability to do laser etching on the top. So if you wanted to put a logo of the school on the oh, top of the very device, cool. you can absolutely do that. Very cool. Uh, in addition to all those, mm -hmm. you could also do multi-year multi, multi -year warranties, right? right? So these schools are going to make an investment in technology. Mm -hmm. It'd be great to know that these systems are going to be taken care of for you know two, three, four years down the road. Right, so we've got a, essentially a full set of enterprise business level service offerings that are available to schools for a, a set of education products. That's exactly right. Yeah. That's exactly right. Yeah. I think it's going to be uh, be compelling. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. So um, as you can see, folks, you have four different combinations and permutations of OS and form factor offering here. Classic ThinkPad, reliability, durability, service offerings. Um, all in all, I think it's a, uh, a very strong successor to our previous education products. That, that's what we're hearing from our customers, so we're, we're yeah. glad to be able to make it available. Good. Very well received. Yep. All right. Thank you, David. Thank you, Kevin. Okay. Thank you, folks. This has been Kevin Beck. David Harris. Uh, with first look for the ThinkPad 11E. Uh, for more information, go to Lenovo.com, and we look forward to seeing you again next time.